Tour of your 324 here back again with another video. Today we'll be taking a look at Creo Star Trek Creon Figure Packs by Hasbro. Now I got this uh, for a dollar at my local Dollar Tree or any dollar shop that you would find this in. I'm surprised that I actually saw these guys. Um, I also got this bla black background. I'm testing it out, uh, see how it looks on camera. And yeah, I also got this uh, at the dollar store too. Now, uh, this is a Creo set or, or a Creo figure, a uh, blind bag. Um, and it's from Star Trek, so we have is Klingong. I, I don't really follow Star Trek. I just saw these and I thought they were neat, so I had to pick them up. You got Kenzer, we got Lieutenant Sprog, Gars. Gracia, Gorn, Captain Nero. He looks pretty cool. Alright, so let's open one of these up and see what's inside. Alright. Okay. Looks like we have Lieutenant Sprog, which shows you how to assemble him. So here it is. So let me just grab my scissors here that open okay so let me assemble this guy which is pretty much basic kind of like a Lego but I guess you could say it's the cheap knockoff version of it so there is Lieutenant Sprog which I think looks pretty cool and he also has this gun. So we're getting a closer look at that. Hmm. I can focus. It's not really focusing well. So it looks really nice. You can see his gun here. Now for the articulation, he does have head rotation. Arms do go all the way around. It's on a ball joint. He has a waist swivel. His legs are on a ball joint too, and that's pretty much it. So there you got that, so let me just peg in um, Lieutenant Sprog, which is kind of funny looking name. And there's his little gun here, which I'll just attach. It's, it's kind of hard to get in, but you can see. Let's take a closer look at his head. That looks pretty cool. Now opening up the second package right here, see what this could be. Hopefully we don't get a duplicate. Oh, what is this? Looks like we got Kiel Klinglong, Klinglong, whatever. Got a cool weapon accessory, so that's pretty cool. Oh, it looks like he has a cape too or something. Oh, that's pretty cool. Let's grab these scissors here again. Hmm. Sorry that I failed at cutting. <clears throat> so I think we need the... Or you know what? We can guess it. Alright. Let's get back into focus. So here's the front. And then I'll attach on his head here. His little body. His little legs. And for his cape. Let's look at this. We have to fold it in. First, let's take these things off. It's like an adventure, guys. We're actually looking at this guy and we're assembling him as we speak. Alright, there we go. Now, where does this go? Oh, it goes on his arms here. So, if you unpeg his arms here, it just attaches on like that. And then you peg one of his arms back in, like so. There we go. And then you fold these out, 
like so. And then his weapon here, which you could just hold. And there we go. There is Kringlong, whatever his name is. You could comment down below to tell me what his name is or how to pronounce it. So um, his weapon here looks really cool. His head does rotate all the way around. Kind of has this like rubbery texture to it. Same as this guy right here. He has bull jointed arms. His chest or his waist can rotate all the way around and he has ball jointed feet. It also has two pegs at the bottom which can peg onto this base right here, which is really cool. Now for a dollar, it's it's not that bad. It is Creo, so you're going to expect something different. You just... So uh, it's, it's not bad. And um, let me put him right here. What's really funny is when you look at the instruction booklet, it shows this thing, it, it shows that it's shiny and this is what we get, just a little gray piece of plastic which is, which is very unfortunate. It would have been cool if we have that uh, nice and shiny weapon that he has. So, it looks pretty cool. Um, it, it was fun collecting these. I'll, I'll just buy two for now. Uh, in the future I might get some. Just comment down below if you want me to, if you want me to get more of these guys. Um, I don't know if they're interesting to you guys, if there's any Star Trek fans out there. Let me just pull this up right here, I'm not going to keep these. Uh -huh. Alright, so that is it. Hope you guys like it. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. And uh, comment down below if you uh, want me to review more of these guys or or my new background right here, which is black. So yeah, hope you guys like it. Torvir, signing out. Peace.